Gernot, we are going to look ahead to the match against Heerenveen. But first, how do you look back on that wonderful match against PSV? Yeah, it was a great performance uh, on Sunday. Uh, it was a perfect day for us. Uh, I think we we did it quite well. Uh, it was uh, not so easy to win there. It was a close game, but I think uh, we scored in the right time. And uh, so this was a, uh, yeah, a good day for us. But uh, we have to stay focused because, of course, it's it's uh, an important win, but it's just about three points. And uh, yeah, we have to uh, get the next three points uh, on Wednesday. It was a real team effort, but how do you look back on your own performance? Yeah, I tried to give my best. I think uh, the first half we did some some good good build up and uh, defended well. The second half was just only about defending, but we tried to to keep them away from our goal and uh, we had some really good counter attacks and uh, that was the way we uh, we finished this game. And in the press they talk about the Bermuda Triangle, so um, you, uh, Senesi and, and uh, Justin, uh, seven games, seven clean sheets. I think that's uh, very nice. Yeah, of course. Uh, we are pretty proud of that because it's not easy to play seven games uh, with a clean sheet. But uh, it's not only about us. All the players are working hard for, uh, for defense and so it's a team effort and it's not only about us. And according to the statistics, uh, you played very well against PSV, but you did not make any sliding tackles. Um, can you explain that? Is that because you're always in the right position? Yeah, I think uh, sliding tackle, tackling looks always uh, uh, good for the, for the fans, but it's, it's, I think in my, in my opinion, it's always the, the last uh, opinion to choose, because when you're on the floor, you have to get up and m when you when the, the striker makes a cut, he, you, you will be out, so uh, try to, to uh, stay on my feet and uh, yeah, sometimes it's necessary, but um, yeah, in this, in this match it wasn't necessary. And there was a moment in the match, uh, you collided with Marcus uh, very, just as hard. Uh, what happened over there and how is he now? Yeah, it was a little bit of a crazy moment. Um, I didn't see him, I just watched the ball and I think he did the same. So yeah, we both want, uh, wanted to attack the ball, but nobody of us got it. So yeah, I'm happy that nothing uh, nothing happened to him. So he's okay, he will be able to play, I think. And yeah, we've talked about it, but uh, yeah, we should try that it's uh, not, that it not happens again. It seems like he's, uh, he's okay for the match against uh Irvine, and how are you going to look forward to the match against uh, Irvine? Yeah, we, we have to st stay focused because um, now we had an important win on the on the weekend, but this one is much more important. We have to to show that we are a top team, that we can perform uh, like that uh, every three four days, and yeah, that's up to us to show that. And I hope uh, um, yeah we can win. Uh, I'm looking forward uh, to playing the Quip again with our fans. Heerenveen will play in a different way than PSV, but is it still possible to take things from the match against PSV to the match uh, against Heerenveen? Yeah, as you said, it will be a completely different uh, game, but I think uh, our coach will have a good idea. Um, I think when we have a good match plan, we, um, yeah, we, can, we can beat them, but it's, of course it's, it will be hard work.